so hello guys it's me iron star as you guys know and so i'm back here i'm gonna post a video today and as you guys know i always start with the lesson profile and my name iron star and the day is wednesday so let's move on to the next slide so the topic is food for thought today you might be thinking it should be research and food for thought but no today i'm gonna do a topic and if you guys have any other um mystery topics for me so i'm gonna do the research in it i'm gonna make sure uh, everything goes best and so i hope you like the pictures and if you have any question don't hesitate to ask me post in the community tab or in the comments down below and if they're dis disabled so you can just post a message in the community tab so let's move on to the next slide so what is a balanced diet a diet consisting of a variety of different types of food and providing adequate amounts of the nutrients necessary for a good health. Educate means here equal and nice amounts of food. And in clear words, it's written here that diet is different types of um, a diet is a variety of different types of food. A diet has a lot of different types of food. Uh, foods you can say and then it provides adequate amounts of the nutrients necessary for good health it means that right here etiquette means that it provides the equal amount necessary for your body or good health and so in the next um heading you can say you need different sorts of food for energy growth and health uh, so let's learn about them one by one so let's move on to the next slide food for energy this photograph shows you that you give energy foods that give you energy butter and cooking oil contain fat jam bread and pasta contain carbohydrates sweet things contain a lot of carbohydrates called sugar bread and pasta contain different types of carbohydrates called starch in clear words it's written that butter cooking oil contain fat and the sweet things you eat like jam cakes toffees or something like that contain carbohydrates which are called sugar we use sugar in many different ways and bread and pasta can also contain carbohydrates but the word of carbohydrates used is called starch so let's move on to the next slide so food for health Fruits and vegetables contain fiber, which keeps your insides healthy. They also contain vitamins and minerals, which keeps your body working properly. Calcium is a mineral that helps to make bones and teeth healthy and can be found in milk. So in clear words, every definition has clear words meaning, as you guys can see, so vegetables and fruits contain fiber and which keeps the insides of you healthy also they contain vitamin and minerals which helps your body go perfectly working perfectly and then we've got calcium it's a mineral that helps your bones and teeth healthy and can be found in milk so let's move on to the next slide diet the word diet means that what you eat if you eat foods from different food groups carbohydrate fats proteins vitamins and minerals fiber you'll have a balanced diet simply so in clear words it's written that diet means that what you eat whatever you eat is your diet don't think diet means to make yourself thinner having fit diet is whatever you eat even like little parsley leaves that's the diet what you eat and so there are different foods from you from which you have your diet like dairy groups or carbohydrates fats and proteins and then you have a balanced diet take a small amount of food from each group and then you can have a balanced diet to yourself so let's move on to the next slide so food labels labels on the food tell you what is in them this label from a cereal pack tells that it contains a lot of carbohydrates so basically we are gonna learn about food labels too which you can find at the back or at the bottom of any box so
So the two right here are from a cereal pack. I don't know what's the company basically, but they are both from a cereal pack, A and B. So both have a lot of carbohydrates. Cereals have a little bit of sugar and then they also have starch as if they're made from wheat or something like that. So let's move on to the next slide. So don't forget to like and subscribe to my channel. I'm going to post new videos every time and I hope you guys will love them. So move the curtains. Thank you for your time. I had a wonderful time with you guys. I hope you enjoyed the video and once again, close the curtains. Don't forget to like and subscribe to my channel. So bye.